everyone, my name is Annette McNamara. I am a photographer here in Nashville. I've been in Nashville almost six years. Just to tell you a little bit about me, I am a small town girl from Iowa that hopped on a bus to move to California, then flew on a plane to go to Missouri, and then divine intervention, or I don't know what it was that brought me to Nashville, but this is the place for me. Uh, a little bit about my muse. I never thought that I actually had one for a long time because I've been into photography for a really long time. But when I lived in Missouri, I met my friend, Isaac. This is Isaac. Uh, he used to do my hair and I told him once that I really liked gas masks and he was like, hey, I have a gas mask. And so he dressed up for me and went out and got bitten by a bunch of mosquitoes and um, posed for this awesome picture. Then, I also photographed him several other times, half naked, um, just fun stuff that I've done with him over the years. But we actually, all of these portraits and fun stuff actually brought along the biggest project of my life that I'm the most proud of, and he was one of the inspirations for it. So Isaac is gay, who cares, right? But I've noticed that some of the world looks at him differently. And as I've grown up, I've noticed that the world looks at a lot of people differently, whether you're fat, you're thin, you're um, black, you're white, you're Asian, you're Jewish, you're Christian, you're a drag queen, you're whatever. Uh, a lot of times people's views of those things are very different because they don't know that person. So about a year ago, I started a project called Beautiful Strength. And in that project, I took portraits of people and let them write their story on the photo. So to give you an example, this is not Isaac. <laughs> Hold on, go back. That's not Isaac either. Ta -da -da. This is Isaac. There he is. I don't know if you can see that. I hope so because he is an amazing person inside and out. And he is one of the inspirations for this project I call Beautiful Strength, which I photographed over 200 people last year. I'm going around doing all different types of people, letting them tell their stories in their own handwriting on their portraits. So my goal going forward is this year I'm planning on turning it into a nonprofit and then I'm also building a bus. So I just bought a school bus, it's about a 40 foot school bus, could be wrong on that, maybe 30, I don't know, but it's big and I'm converting it into a studio on the back and a living space on the front so I can travel all around the United States next year capturing even more stories. So this is inspired by Isaac. I still love photography. I still love doing um, musicians and bands and stuff, but quite honestly, like this project has incorporated everything that I've ever loved from photos to human stories to chasing just inspiration everywhere and really getting to know people and letting other people get to know them because we're all more than what you can just see on the outside. So that is basically me in a nutshell. I would love to talk more about this project and let people know about it. It is a piece of art. It is something that is super heartfelt to me. And I think that a lot of people are going to really enjoy it because we're all crazy creatives and we all want to be part of something and we all want to be heard. And I would love to tell people more about it. Thanks guys.